Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for taking time out of your busy day and busy schedules to watch one of my videos. And if you are returning for your second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, or many more times, thank you as well so much for taking time out of your busy day and busy schedules to come on back and watch yet again another one of my videos. So in today's video, um, I have a lot to like show you guys, to talk to you guys about. And I have like so many plans of videos that I want to do very soon. Um, <coughs> sorry, we have all been sick in my house, so I haven't been posting like, and I, I still have videos that I made from before Christmas and I just have not had time to post them between work and, um, work, Christmas, New Year's, um, and being sick and filling in for people at work that have been sick. It's been very, very hectic lately. The last couple weeks have just been crazy, crazy. So, um, I'm back and hopefully we can keep this going because I still want to really, really, really do. And I am hopefully going to make it tonight. I'm not sure yet when I'm going to be able to post it, but I really want to do like the self-awareness video and talk to you guys about like um physical and mental um abuse and um lots of things like that so depression and other things so that is plans for my next video but yeah so i still have a lot of videos to even post yet i'm making another one so i wanted to show you guys my christmas stuff everything i got for christmas and whatnot um and just like things that i bought and things like that so that's what today's video is going to be and then like i said if i am still up to it i don't know i've just been kind of like down and blah lately honestly like i just have not been myself and this new year is just starting out awful in my opinion so it's just been crazy like I said I mean first my older son was sick then my younger son got sick then I got sick then my husband got sick and then like we were all starting to finally get better and then my um, husband got like coughing like fit from being sick like we just had like basic colds at first and then so like he was coughing like crazy and then I swear he gave it to me and our youngest son again so we've all it's just been going around our house thankfully my daughter has not gotten it knock on wood but um yeah so if I'm like out of breath it's just because my chest is still congested but I'm still trying to make this video for you guys because I want to. <clears throat> sorry so these were my new year's nails they were really a lot longer um yeah I had so many issues with these nails so I mean they were really long um but I loved them for new year's and they were cute they were kiss nails so literally this hand particularly these three fingers fell off four times not fell off but they snapped in half like I wasn't even like doing anything like literally I was taking clothes out of the dryer the one day and literally it just snapped in half and I'm like what the heck and then it did it again like the same day and then the next day another one did it and then the next day another one did it so I was not happy so I just cut them down and I'm like you know what I'm just gonna cut them down for now and just keep them on because I really wanted to wear them for New Year's because I thought they were just really pretty and sparkly for New Year's so I just like I said just cut them down really quick and just decided to keep them on for New Year's and I'm going to take them off here probably maybe tonight or tomorrow I'm not sure yet but I have a couple days off so I'm super excited because I really really need it right now <coughs> Anyways, let's get into the video. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you um, basically what I got for Christmas um, and whatnot and what I love, what I don't love so much. But anyways, 
let's just jump into it. So I'm going to start with, and I was so angry. I ordered nails from Sheen and I've been meaning to like write them because I'm kind of like really mad about it because I ordered these nails like two months prior to Christmas because I know how long Sheen takes to send out things like I mean it takes a couple weeks before you get stuff from them but I ordered Christmas nails and all these nails and I didn't get them until like two days after Christmas and I was well like a day after Christmas I should say but still I didn't get them until a day after Christmas so I was kind of disappointed and now I have to wait until next year to use and wear them so but let's just start off with that and let me show you guys what I got from Sheen for nails and another thing I was very disappointed because you know some of them are like really cute and really nice and stuff and sometimes when you order them like they look nothing like what the picture looks like and they're super ugly so and a, quite a few of them I don't like at all like these ones oh my god you guys will see in a minute <laughs> I'm sorry I'm like just coughing up a storm because I'm talking up a storm anyhow I hope everybody else has had a wonderful Christmas and a wonderful New York New New Year's New Year's um but yeah let's just jump into it okay because okay. I'm gonna keep yapping there was something else I was just gonna say and I completely like it just completely like slipped my mind so I wrote a bunch of things down and I tried to triple check to make sure I have everything to show you guys in this video. So let me grab it because some of them, of course, fell. <coughs> Alright, so we're just going to go through. Like I said, I was disappointed because a lot of these are Christmassy and so these ones are really cute. It's kind of hard to see them in this. My camera, my phone is so horrible. So these are like, they got like purple tips with like a gold stripe there. And then they got like little snowflakes on them. So, I mean, they are Christmassy kind of, but I guess, I guess you could say that it's not like fully a snowflake, so you could probably wear them still. Can you guys see that any good? God, I hate the lighting of my phone. It's horrible. Okay, so I bought those ones. These ones are really, really like, and they're really cute. So these are just pink and white, um, pink and white ones, but they're really cute, I think. So I really, really like those ones. I thought those were really pretty. And then we have, well, these ones I just pulled out. You guys have seen these ones before in my collection. Um, but the, it was between these and the ones that I have on now that I was going to wear for New Year's. So, but I picked the ones that I have on, have on now because they're just sparkly and I thought they were very New Year's -y. So these ones are very pretty. I really like these ones a lot. So they have little butterflies, like a little flower, and then like um, just the half of the nail and the white French, basically, but it's like glittery. They're really pretty. These ones are one of my favorites that I got. I love the little butterflies. I love the little gems. However, they get caught on everything. They seriously get caught on like so much stuff. Then I just bought these ones. They're just pink with cherries on them. So I was trying to stay away from the gems because of the fact that I do a lot with my hands. I'm always like washing clothes and cleaning and doing things at work even and stuff. So I tried to buy more without gems and things on them. Um, so I went with just the pink with the painted on little, oh, they're actually hearts. So. These will actually be really cute for Valentine's Day. I thought they were cherries, but they are, well, they look like cherries, but they're actually little hearts. So I think I'll probably save these and wear these ones for Valentine's Day because they are really cute for Valentine's Day. <coughs> and I really like them. All right, 
right next ones are these ones. They're a little, um, like a little bit see-through, which I don't really like as much because for me personally, I don't like when they're so clear that you can like see the glue through them. Um, and I try to put the glue on like perfectly so that you really can't see it through them, but somehow there's always like one or two that you can see through, but they are really pretty. I just wish that they were not as see-through like. All right, so these ones are also pretty, and these say they're from Rom Romwe. I don't even know how you say that, but anyways, they're just French, side French, and then they have like the heart going all the way around and the little rhinestones on these two. And then these ones are white, and they actually have two little rhinestones at the bottom, so... These are really pretty too. Next ones are these, are these ones. So these have like pink glitter French tips and then they have a little pink butterfly and then they're just French for the rest. So they're cute, not too shabby. <coughs> oh my goodness. These ones are kind of like I don't know, they remind me of like little ballet shoes, but I still think they're kind of cute. Um, they're just like these pink squigglies and white. So, I don't know. I think they're pretty though. I don't know if I liked them as much at first, but they're, they're cute. I actually think that they'd be kind of cute because it kind of looks like, no, I didn't realize this before, but it looks like, Oh yeah, I think it is. It's like a heart design if you put them upside down like that. So it's like a heart in pink there and a heart in a pink there. So again, these would be really cute for um, Valentine's Day as well. The next ones I got these. And these are all from Sheen. At least that's where I ordered them all from. Oh no. I don't know why they're like in different packaging and stuff sometimes though. So next I got these ones. They're okay. They're not as pretty as I thought they were going to be. But they're, they're, I mean, they're pretty. I just don't know if I love, love them. They're pretty. They're, they're like a baby blue. They're, they kind of look purplish a little bit in my phone, but they really are like a baby blue color. And they just have like the little flowers and the little pearls on them. I mean, they're pretty. They're just, they're cute. Just not my favorite. These ones, okay, so these are okay. I feel like these ones are kind of like chunky looking though to me. Like they look fat, like wide. Um, and they're, they're, I don't know. I love these ones with the rhinestones. These are so pretty. I don't think I really like these ones though. Um, and then these ones also have little rhinestones at the bottom. So we'll, we'll see. I mean, I do have honestly like kind of wider fingers as well. My fingers are a little bit, um, my nails are a little bit wider and fatter. So, you know, that might just be perfectly fine. But they look really like, I don't know if it's just that they look really cheaply like, or if they just look too wide in a sense. Because they're a lot wider than the other ones. And I like when they're really like thin and skinny like, um, oh god, I can't remember which pair I put on. But they were my all time, absolute favorite pair I bought from Sheen. I loved the shape. I loved the style of them. They were just so natural, pretty, and cute. It's really hot in my bathroom, you guys. I don't know why, but I'm, like, sweating. It's also, like, I swear, like I said, this year is it just begun, and it's already starting off absolutely horrible because it's that time of the month, too. So it's, like, just everything all at once. Yeah, just, no. Don't even want to talk about it right now. So that's for the next video. All right, so these ones are actually prettier than I expected them to be. Um, 
I didn't know if I loved these when I ordered them because they weren't like fully me, but they're actually kind of pretty when I got them. So this is more of like the shape that I like, honestly, like just like the thinner kind of like perfect um, ballerina. I don't know. That's a, my nail place that I used to get my nails done at used to say is this shape and style that I like is ballerina so and he's to do an amazing amazing job so if you live in Cape Coral Cape Coral god I can't even talk to Cape Coral Florida or near here and you want a really good nail person a like amazing nail tech that'll do like exactly how you want your nails let me know and I will hook you up with my man Ben because he is the best I've ever had. Okay, so these are absolutely awful. These are so freaking long and so ugly. And they didn't even say like, you know, sometimes if you go onto Sheen and you go to the nails, you can type in extra long. These did not even say they were extra long. And they are freaking ginormous. I mean... Hey, if y'all like this kind of style, to each their own. But these are just way, way too, too wide and too long for me. Like, I like my nails long, but these are just a little bit too... They're just so chunky and they're really so long. Like, <clears throat> you guys can't even really tell, like, that much. I don't feel like as much as you can in real life as in the camera like I feel like they don't look that horrible on the camera but they really are they're they're humongous and it's too bad too because they're kind of pretty I kind of like I love leopard print so I love the leopard print design and everything so I wish they were cuter nails but smaller Okay, these ones I don't like at all. I think they look too fake and too kiddish for me. So they're these blue and white ones. And yeah, I just, I don't like them at all. I probably never wear these ones. Um, yeah, they're just not pretty, I think. If you like them, your opinion, of course. And this is mine. <laughs> so... Yeah, I don't know. I just don't like the white and blue. Like, I, I feel like they don't look natural. And they're just, like, too much. So, those I don't like. These are Christmas ones again. So, they have little snowflakes. I love the little packaging on this one, though. Isn't that so cute with the little Santa? And these are cute, though. They got the little snowflakes and the little, like, just stripes on the other ones. Those are pretty. We're coming up to my faves in a minute. I'm going to save my favorites for the last. Again, these ones are kind of Christmassy. They're a little bit see-through, but they're pretty. Um, so you got the, like, snowflake one here and then just the white front and the um, silver glitter on those ones a lot of them like kind of look the same but see how many Christmas ones I got y'all and I can't even wear them now until next year and then these ones they're okay I don't like them as much as I thought I would but these ones are definitely Christmas ones they say um ho 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 and they have a little reindeer on them and they're pink Christmas ones. So these are really cute. But unfortunately, I have to wait for next year to wear these ones, of course. So, a little bit annoying. Alright, last but not least are my absolute favorite ones. Well, I do and don't like these ones, to be honest. Like, I don't know if I like the, the brown, like... I don't know. I wish. I don't know if I wish that it was pink or not. But then it might not look good, as good pink. So, but I love. I love the color of these ones. They're like a mint green. 
and they have like pearl and rhinestones, pearls and rhinestones on them. And they have little two of them with the little pom poms on them, which I know I said I'm trying to refrain from buying stuff with things on them. But I gotta pull these out and show y'all. I gotta see them because I haven't even seen them yet. But y'all, they're little pom poms, and pom poms are just so freaking cute. And I saw a girl. This was a long time ago, but I saw a girl at a store that had little pom-poms on her nails. And I just thought they were freaking adorable. So, let's see how they even look. Okay, so I don't know if they look as cute as, like, what I expected. But they got little pom-poms on them. The pom-poms actually look blue. And the nails are green. So, I feel like it doesn't look at that. They're blue and these are green. So it doesn't really go. <sighs> what a disappointment. Really is so disappointing because it really doesn't. It, I feel like it doesn't match because these are definitely like light blue and these are definitely green. And they would have been so freaking cute. And that's why I bought them because I love the little. I absolutely loved the little pom poms. So. I'm telling you, it's this year already. It's already killing me. It's already been an awful, awful year. I'm not even joking. And it's just begun. Like, I just feel like it's been disappointment after disappointment in these past two days. And honestly, like, I feel like. And I'm not one to do this or say this to anyone. So y'all should feel loved for me even telling you this. Damn, look at that. I'm like sweating. My hair is like getting messed up because of it. <coughs> but I'm just like, I've been in one of those moods where I just want to like break down and just be alone and just cry for like an hour straight. And... I don't know if it's just my hormones going all crazy right now because it's that time of the month or whatnot, but that's honestly how I've been feeling the past few days. So, yeah. And I don't want to talk about that right now because I'm just not in the mood for it. It's supposed to be a happy and fun video, so we're going to make it happy and fun for you guys. That looks horrible right now, by the way. I took a shower. I put no makeup on, no nothing on. So I'm just putting my nails back in this giant bag they sent me of with them. And we're gonna go on to the next stuff. <coughs> oh wait, just show it. Oh yeah, I showed you guys those. Ones. Those ones are ugly. Oh, and then. I was showering and shaving today and shaving my legs and of course I like cut the heck out of the back of my leg and anytime I cut myself when I'm shaving I swear it bleeds like freaking insanely like oh my god like it does not even stop bleeding you guys like it just bleeds like crazy all right so I also got this cute little ring set. I was going to give it to my daughter, but I actually really, really liked it. And it popped up on Sheen, and it was very, very cheap, so I thought, why not? But I might end up giving it to her because I wore it the other day for like 10 minutes, and I started getting hives, and I took it off, and about a half hour later, my hives cleared up, so I can't wear fake stuff. Which just sucks, so. But I got this little pink bow ring set. How adorable is that? I just think that is so, so cute. And then it comes with this one, which is really tiny because it only fits on my pinky. But this one also has a little pink bow and then a little, like, rhinestone looking bow under it so so cute sorry you guys I know my lighting is horrible and the last one let's put 
put on the middle one. This one, like, um, this one and this bow one have, like, the little space so you can kind of make them bigger if you need to or smaller. So this one just has little hearts on it with pink rhinestones in the middle. How adorable are these? They're so, so cute. But I mean, like, I don't like this one, honestly. And it looks like just like those little pink kid stickers like were put inside of this one but that's okay i mainly just bought it for the this one really because i really really love this little pink bow i just thought that was so so cute so cute and then this one too is adorable also but it's so small it only fits on my pinky which makes me sad so yeah so cute and I think, I don't even, like I said, I don't even know what I paid for these, but like, it was very cheap. I want to say it was less than two bucks. I do know that. It might have even been under a dollar. It might have been like 90 something cents. I don't know. But they were so cheap for three cute little rings. Okay, now let's get into the gifts. I'm going to have a sip of water. And we're going to start. All right, so let me just start off by saying um, I did at work, of course. I got money from customers. I got um, some gift cards from customers and from, like, my mom and stuff. So just the basic, you know, gift cards, money. Um, that's about it. We did get a bunny for my youngest son and kind of sort of for me, too, because... I just fell in love with this little bunny at the pet store, so we named him Butterscotch because he is a boy, but we didn't know he was a boy, <laughs> and we kept calling him a she because we didn't know at first, but he's definitely a boy, and so, well, we've been, I've been calling him Butterscotch. My husband calls him Pudding, so each their own. <laughs> All right, let's move on to the stuff. So, my boys got me this cute little set. Um, Smoke and Mirrors. It's by Get Glowing 4-Piece Gorgeous Glow Collection. Illuminating, illuminating Face Primer, Highlighter Stick, Lip Oil, and Freckle Pen. So, I've used the face primer. It is actually so soft and so, it really does. It gives your face like this just beautiful, so pretty, such a pretty, just natural glow. It's really cute. And it's really weird, like, when I first put it out, like, put some on my hand, I was like, ew, this is like yellow and it looks like mustard, but... <coughs> It was really cute. I've been using the lip oil. I already used that and took it out. I've been using this like crazy. It is really, really nice. Very good lip oil. I love it. I actually put some on right now for you guys. The only thing I don't like about the lip oil is it is definitely watermelon scented. It doesn't say that, but it smells like watermelon, and I don't necessarily like watermelon. However, I don't mind it in this because it's just good. Now, the freckle pencil, I will probably never use, but everything else in here I will use. I have not tried the highlighter stick yet, but I will. Actually, I'm going to leave that out because I have been using that lip stuff for like every day all right so my daughter has these shoes and I love them I have been admiring them in her closet and she was like so excited she's so cute she's 18 granted but I was totally surprised because I was not expecting them and I had been like, oh my god, I love these shoes. I want them in her closet. So she bought me them. They are from Target, if anybody, like, really loves them, like I do. Um, they're from Target. 
They are $29.99. She ordered mine online. I don't know if they had them in the store. I don't know if she ordered hers online, but she ordered mine online. So they were $30. And they are memory foam. They say memory foam on the tag. So they are just super cute. Super cute. Like the perfect size heel, um, you know, just like that tan natural color to go with pretty much anything. And I absolutely adore and love them. I love them. I was so happy to get that. Oh, I also got like candy and snacks, of course, too, from my kids, my husband. Um, I got these two nail polishes. I really like this color. I actually have it on my toes right now. It's just a very pretty um, color. So I got that. And then I got this one, which is really pretty as well. It's like this, I don't even know, like a rose gold chrome kind of color. Like it's so hard to see my camera. I'm sorry, you guys. I hate this lighting. I really do. And this is called um, Queen Bee. And it's by Believe Beauty, which I am seriously starting to become obsessed with Believe products. And I will show you. I'm going to show you next some of the stuff. This I bought for myself. But, oh, my god so i bought this believe beauty face toning mist an energizing mist that delivers a boost of hydration while toning skin infused with witch hazel and lotus extract amazing you guys this is the dollar general like this brand is from dollar general um i don't know if anybody else carries it i really don't but i buy the um I buy their foundation too in the shade buff and I love it. I use it every day. I mix it with my Maybelline foundation. I do, but that their foundation is more like wet and like a little bit lighter of coverage. So, and then my Maybelline is more like a drier foundation and a little bit more thicker. So when I mix the two together, I feel like I get the perfect consistency and the perfect foundation for me. Um, but yeah, this stuff is amazing. Like their products are incredible, but I have something even better. So I have not tried this yet. This is the Believe Beauty Master at Matte Makeup Setting Spray. So I'm super excited to try this. I did use the Pretty and Primed Hydrating Primer. It's not that great. I'm not going to lie. This one is not that great. I wouldn't recommend buying the primer of their product. But if you want good products for very reasonably priced, definitely buy the face toning mist because this stuff's amazing. But this is my favorite. Oh my God, you guys. This stuff is so freaking amazing it really is so this is believe beauty and it is moisturizing cream a rich cream that leaves skin soft and supple infused with japanese camellia and vitamin e for normal to dry skin so this stuff is so so great and you honestly get quite a bit i mean you only need a very little bit so there's still a lot in there. I've obviously used it already. Um, but I mean, I think it was like less than five bucks. And it is the best moisturizer I have ever had. I use this day and night um, before I go to bed. And I use it in the morning before I put on my makeup. It smells so good and it feels so amazing. And it really makes your skin, like, they aren't kidding when they say, like, it makes your skin soft and supple. Like, it really does. And it makes your skin, like, just such a beautiful, natural glow to it. It's such a good product. I am seriously obsessed 
Like I am in love with this stuff. So if you're looking for a great moisturizer and even if you have sensitive skin or anything, like, I mean, me of all people, I have incredibly sensitive skin. I mean, I break out in hives from so many things. Like I have so many hair products and stuff. Like I cannot use anything with wheat germ oil. I cannot use any of like that grow hair stuff. Um, any of those products. I don't know what they have in them, but whatever there is in those, they make my freaking scalp like break out. Like I swear to you, I have like lumps on my scalp and my scalp will burn and hurt and itch and it's horrible. By the way, I cut my hair the other day and it's still longer on this side. And I didn't even touch this side. I just cut this side and I literally swear I cut like three inches off of this side and nothing off of this side I, I cut it like just a teeny tiny bit on this side and it still looks longer on this side <clears throat> so I'm probably gonna have to cut it yet again all right I want to get this video done and I have to delete some stuff because I only have 55 minutes of filming time right now it says so let's keep going so, my mother bought me these. She bought me these. I don't even know where she got them. I'm about to ask her. She got me these two Betty Coro, Cora, Cora, Betty Cora Salon Holding Hands. I don't know. I don't know where she got these or where she found them. So, this one's nail glue and this one is nail glue remover. And this works so great. I just put a little bit of this around my nails to get these off and they come off like just put a little bit around there wait like five seconds literally and I just take another nail and they come right off. It is so so good. So I'm gonna look online probably because I don't know. It didn't seem like this was a full bottle of this. It seemed like it was just half empty. She could have got it at like a, I don't know, thrift store or something. I don't really know. But this is a great product. So if you want something to help you get your, get your glue ons or your press on nails off super easy or get the glue off, period. Like, I mean, this takes the glue off of your nails and it works. <clears throat> oh, sorry. So we still got this cough. I'm trying to get rid of it. All right, I'm gonna go into these sprays really quick. So the first one is Kimberly's Sinful Berry, and my kids got these at five and below. That smells pretty good. This one I actually like. Normally I don't really like these ones particularly, the Kimberly's. Like, but look at how cute that little bottle is. It's like a chocolate covered strawberry. So cute. And actually it smells very good. One great thing I must say is like Five Below has some amazing sprays for five bucks. I mean, and they smell really good. So this one is probably my favorite. I've been using this one a lot lately. And it's, I have no idea how you say it. <laughs> O-U-I-M-O-I. -I Glitter. Horfemme. But look at how gorgeous this bottle is. It looks like a little lipstick. It's got the little lips and gold glitter there. Oh, and it smells so good. I got the last one of these. I was with my son when I bought this one and I was like mm, I want that it's great it smells very fruity but like I don't even know how to explain it it's like a fruity really very pretty smell I think and I love it and I just absolutely love the bottle so I probably would have got two if they had to but 
They only had one left of this one, so I got the last one. And the last one is Viva Las Vegas Nights, which I haven't even used yet. But again, such a pretty bottle. Look at how pretty that is. Look how big that is. Like, it just reminds me of Juicy Couture. And let's see what it smells like. Okay, that, it's okay. I'm not super in love with this scent, but it's, it's not bad. But the bottle is so gorgeous again. And like I said, for five bucks, their sprays and perfumes and stuff are just such a great deal. We bought, um, I had the boys buy their dad, um, cologne ones and their grandpa, which my stepdad and, um, their brothers and stuff. Like they all bought each other, all bought each other cologne. So then my mother got me, sorry, I'm grabbing it. My mother bought me this Caribbean coconut body spray. This one's body and hair mist. So this smells really good. And then she got me Bath and Body Works at the beach. I think this is the one that, I don't know. One of them I liked, one of them I think is okay. But yeah, got those two. Alright, I'm going to pause you guys for one minute because I'm running out of film time and I still got a lot to show you guys. So... I think I'm just going to try to go through a couple more things and then I'm going to have to delete some videos and make a second video. So let me pause you guys for one second. Oh, I still have so much to show you guys. All right. Let's just like run through some stuff quickly. So these were in my stocking stuffers. So these are little beauty blenders from the Dollar Tree. How cute. So I got star ones and then I got heart ones, which I put somewhere. There they are. trying to reach it. I'm sorry. And then I got these little fingertip ones. How cute are these? They're like under my eyes. I think these are going to be so great. And they're latex free. So you just put your little finger in there and they're little finger beauty blenders. How cute. And these are the little heart ones. Perfect for like Valentine's Day for like a little gift for a little girl. So this is all from the Dollar Tree. If you're looking for something cute for your daughters. Oh, there's another nail I forgot. That happened to be up top. So there's these ones. They have little butterflies. They're pink and white. And again, rhinestones. They're okay. Alright, so I bought this when I was at the Dollar Tree. I wanted to just try it. Um, it's a good... It's, you know, a more expensive brand, so it's a brow contour. Um, so, yeah, I just bought one to try it. We'll see how it works. I will let you guys know. Maybe I'll do a video, a makeup video, and use this. Okay, we're running out of time. Um, I got more of my foundation. Like I said, I went to another Dollar Tree, Dollar General, because ours has not been restocking my buff or my Believe Beauty foundation. So this is what I do use in the color buff. And then in these, I bought the wrong colors, y'all. So I thought it was 125 that I usually use, but it's actually 220 or 225 now. I don't know, but I must have changed it. In the past few years because this one's darker but because I used to use one of these colors and I thought it was 125 so I don't know I bought both of them so we'll see hopefully they'll be okay I got deodorant I need a deodorant okay so these I got for Christmas from my husband I got the tree hut in vanilla this is the Shea Sugar Scrub OMG. 
Geez, smells amazing. Oh my God, I love that. I love it. These are so great. They smell so amazing, but this one has to be my all-time favorite. The pineapple. Oh my God, again, smells so freaking awesome. Oh God, it just smells so tropical. I mean, I love the pineapple. The pineapple is definitely my favorite. So I'm so excited. I haven't used them yet just because I've been waiting to show you guys this video first. So figured I'd show them to you before I use them. All right, let's see what else I can show you guys really quick before my video runs out and then I have to make another one. So we got these. I was going to get these for my daughter, but I ended up keeping them for myself because I just thought they were so cute. So it is a five piece lip oil set. She had plenty enough gifts because she wanted a, um, oh my God, I can't even think of what they're called now. I don't know, the expensive laptops, the MacBook Pros. So, yeah. She got plenty for Christmas this year. So I kept these for myself and I just think they're so pretty. So these are all the colors. We got Diamond, Vanilla Sky, um, Golden Hour, Mauve Kiss, and Hot Cocoa. So I'm super excited. They're very pretty. This one's like a very light chrome, um, like white, like iridescent chrome, whatever you want to call it. This one's like a light brownish color and these are by BB. This one's a yellow, this one's a pink, and this one is like an orangish brown, which I probably won't use this one, but love all the rest. So that's for me. I got that sugar scrub on my hand. My mother bought me this beautiful sweater. So, so pretty. And everybody's like, oh my God, that is your color girl. That looks so cute on you. It's so pretty. And it's been cold in Florida, so I've actually been able to wear stuff like this. Look at how pretty this is. Oh, it is so soft. It's just so, so gorgeous. It really is. It's, it fits me beautifully. It's so cute. So comfortable. I absolutely love this. I think it is really pretty. And normally, like, I am so happy when my mom doesn't buy us clothes, me and my daughter, because... We all three have like completely different styles when it comes to clothes a lot of times. So, yeah. So, um, but that she did good on. It looked really good on me and I really liked it. Oh, uh, what else? All right. I'm going to show you guys one more thing and then I'm going to end out this video and just put the rest of the stuff in the next video. I think. So, we got this Physician's Formula. It's got, oh my God, oops, that was just all over it. What was it? This? Like it's been sitting on my floor. That is another thing. Like, it is so dusty in Florida. Everything gets so dusty. Look at this. It's been sitting on my floor for two days. Well, like, on a table. And there's dust all over it. I hope I don't break out in hives now from it. So this is Physician Formula, it's got a setting powder and dewy balm, plus a moisturizer and a cleanser. So, um, and it's rose all day, brightens and tightens, cleanser, set and glow, and moisturizer. So it's very pretty. I don't know how much it was because it definitely wasn't $40, it was like in this box. <clears throat> and I asked the lady how much it was. I want to say maybe it was like $14.99 for it or something, she said. Um, so I ended up getting it. Super, super cute. Let's see if I have time for one more. We got five more minutes. Uh, we got another spray, Be Sexy NYC. This one smells good as well. I haven't opened it, but again, I was with my boys, so I kind of picked out most of the sprays. What else do we got here? Not all you guys saw. Let's get some candy. Kind of threw stuff in here, some stuff is from work. And I 
there's just a lot of stuff from the flea market in here too. Then, um, that's basically pretty much it. Um, my mom got me sheets, she got me a new shower curtain, she got me bathroom rugs, she got me a blanket. So I'm gonna return it because it's like a really, um, like a real fuzzy hot blanket. And I'm super, super hot when I sleep. So, like, but yet I have to have a blanket. I have to have a comforter, but I get so hot when I sleep. So, it has to be cold. And I even told her that, but I love her. Um, so we also got this. It is a neck massager, and I'm going to so take this when we go on our cruise. Um, it's got three intensity levels, travel friendly memory foam, and a USB type C charging port. So I don't know, it just looked really comfortable and cozy. This was $15 at five and below. And it was the last one left. I meant to give this to somebody as a gift, like one of my boys or something, but I forgot. So I'm just keeping it now. And I totally forgot I got my son a mouse pad too because he's always using his Chromebook. And I forgot about this and forgot to give him this for Christmas today. He's going to have a gift in a minute. <clears throat> but yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Um, my mom got me this little fuzzy bag. She actually got it for my daughter, but my daughter didn't want it or like it. So I was like, why not? I'll take it. It's cute. So this is the shower curtain she got for me. It's just a nice big blue one because I told her I want to go with like the ocean beachy theme. And I don't know if I'm going to keep this because it's not exactly what I wanted. But for now, it might actually work because everything in here is blue and my shower curtain is kind of old and gross. So I probably would keep it and use it because it is more of the color scheme that's in my bathroom now than that one. That one's more like a greenish blue, but it's pretty. Like I said, she got me bathroom rugs. She bought, me my, she bought my daughter these nails. And my daughter's like, Mom, you can have them. And I'm like, sorry, Mom. I don't like those at all. I think they're so ugly. I'm sorry if y'all like them out there. They're just not me or my daughter. Like, we both thought they were the ugliest nails ever. In our opinion, no offense to anybody that likes them. We just don't like them. So, yeah. And she bought me new sheets for our beds. And she bought us little calendars. And that is about it, you guys. Oh, and a brush. And a little basket. This Indian coconut nectar perfumed hair and body mist. Looks interesting. I want to smell it now. Oh, God, my video's about done. Ugh. It does not smell good. <laughs> and then I needed a new brush. So she got me a new brush. I think that's pretty much it. Um, anyways, for this video. So, yeah, my kids loved everything they they got, which is, you know, honestly, that's what made my Christmas is making my children happy because it doesn't matter about us anymore, really. It's all about just making them happy, in my opinion. So, yeah, they had a great Christmas. They loved everything they got. They were all three very happy and everything. And um, it was a good Christmas this year. It really was. So it was a fun and good Christmas. We opened our presents in the morning. Then we wrapped my parents' presents really fast because I had to work the day before. And then, yeah, then we uh, went to my parents' house, ate open presents there, and we had a great time for Christmas. So. It was a lot of fun. Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you will hit that like button and make sure to subscribe if you would like to. I would really appreciate it if you did. It would definitely help me out. And I hope you liked the video and I will see you guys very soon for the next one. I promise I am working on it. 
I just want to get, I'm trying to kind of honestly, like I've written down so much stuff that I want to tell you guys about in the next video about, um, you know, just about life and everything in general. And 